Hi everybody, I've been filmed in a little bit. I've been really busy. Um, May 29th, Memorial Day was my birthday. So um, I want to show you what I've been melting and I want to show you what's new and what I got. And what I'm going to be getting pretty soon. I'm going to be getting some Bring Back My Bars pretty soon. So I wanted to share with you um, a couple weeks ago, maybe almost a month, I got the La Habana collection. And I thought this was cool. This sold out with the bag. And two other bars sold out and stuff. Um, I'll start out with, um, I, I'm really bad at pronouncing these, so um, it's going to be a little weird. So, uh, Cafe Cabano, and it said it had roasted, um, you know, coffee tree stuff. And I don't, I'm not going to read the descriptions. Um, and there's sandalwood too. And this, it was good and strong, and it's a good scent, but I'm not really a big fan of the coffee scents really anymore, especially this one. So I only have one of this. I just got the collection. So Calf Cabano, the sandalwood kind of throws it off. Like, it's a strong coffee scent, but the sandalwood, to me, throws it off, but every no everybody's noses are different. So, and I melted a few. This one was strong, by the way. And this is my favorite right now, and this one's sold out. Flair de Merpose. Wait. Flor de Ma Maprosa, um, whatever, Maprosa, I don't know. And it, and to me, it's not a headache type of floral. It's not a strong, straight, um, garden type of floral. It's a sweet, perfumey type of floral. I love this. I wish I could have sucked up on it, but oh well, it's over now. So, and it's a pretty pink wax. This was um, a, probably a medium throw. Um, I had the windows open, so I don't know. But I love this one. It's floral and fruity to me. And I just put this one in just now in my groovy brown tabletop in the corner of my room. I put Hannah um, Habana Virja or something. I probably said that wrong. And it's a man-catching scent. It's And it has tobacco in it and um, I don't know what else um, tobacco in it or something. So, yeah, um, this is pretty good. And the scent's really different. I don't know how to explain it, but it's just a soft vanilla type of, I know there's tobacco in it. You can smell the tobacco, not like cigarette tobacco, like a fancy type of tobacco shop or something. Sorry, I look like a mess right now on camera. And I and this one I melted, Pastelitos, and um, this is throwing good too. So, yeah, Pastelitos is just... um. It's a pineapple, it's just a pineapple scent to me. It's like pina and coladas, you know what I mean? But yeah, this one threw pretty good too. This one was strong. And also, the one that I really like, and this one sold out, I think. Um, Playa de Verado, I, I don't know. Um, it's a fresh scent, and it's kind of perfumey too. I thought this kind of reminded me of vanilla suede. I know that sounds weird, but it reminds me of vanilla suede. Just that dark tone of suede or something. So yeah, I love this. Um, Play de Vare Vadero. I don't know. Um, it's a fresh scent. I turned out to love these scents, and these are my favorites, and these are my least. So I got the collection with the bag online. So I just did a quick order, and I wanted to show you what new bricks I got. I got citrus rosemary, and I was expecting it to be more rosemary. It's strong on the citrus, and it's a clean scent. They said it was. It's just a deep, um, strong citrus, and I can smell a little bit of the rosemary, kind of. It had a um, medium throw. It didn't last long, so I'm kind of disappointed with that, but citrus rosemary is a good scent. That's how much I used of it. And then my last brick was Persian lime and sandalwood, um, so it is is known as number 48 and probably in the groom line for guys and this one turned out to be really good um this one lasts for a little while but um this one lasts more than the citrus rosemary and i finally melted white peach and amber this is a really strong scent and i love white peach and amber and i had it in and i changed it today so i had this in and then i put this one in and then, shortly, real quick, I'll show these fast. I got a couple bars a couple weeks ago. I got two welcome homes. I ran out of welcome home. So, it's just a straight cinnamon, plain light cinnamon. Just a regular cinnamon. And 
I also got French lavender, and I like this because it's a light type of lavender and it's really soothing. I used all those cubes, four cubes, that's what I got left. And I got two bars of Simply Vanilla, and I used one, and I love this. Um, It's good to mix with two, but I don't really mix it. I melt it on its own. So I got that, and then I had this, I had tried a couple cubes from Barrage on this, and I smelled this, and I thought this smelled really good. So I got a new one of My Only Sunshine, and to me it smells fruity and floral, and it smells like a perfume to me. I wasn't expecting, I thought this was going to be a floral scent, but it smells floral, but it's a really good perfumey one. Sorry that I, ugh. But yeah, My Only Sunshine, and those are the bars that I got. Welcome Home and Simply Vanilla. And I wanted to show you one more thing. I have another brick of this to back up. I have a backup, and look how much I use this. I turned out to love this scent. Um, it's just a perfumey type of coconut. It smells more van vanilla. But yeah, I used pretty much all of it, and I have another one to use. So yeah, this is some of the stuff I got. So some bars in the Hannah Cabana collection. And I'm getting some Bring Met My Bars on my next video. And I'm also going to show you my buddy maybe tomorrow or in a couple weeks. Um, I got Lexi the Lemur, and it's coming, and I got two scent packs. But thank you so much for watching, and I hope you some look, somewhat like this video. If you like it, good for you. If thumbs down, don't watch my videos. All right, bye, guys.